Type 2 diabetes is a problem. Um, it's a disease characterized by persistently elevated blood glucose levels. The problem arises because it affects 5 to 10 percent of the population in the UK. It doubles cardiovascular disease related death and also costs the NHS approximately 10 percent of its annual budget. Exercise is used as part of the prevention and treatment of type 2 diabetes because it reduces blood glucose levels. Our work has found that the beneficial effect of this exercise in type 2 diabetes is highly variable between patients. We've been looking to identify the contributing factors to that variability and this can include factors such as adherence to exercise but also more complex phenomena such as genetics, inflammation and hormones. We're trying to tackle these different phenomena so as to produce an individualised approach to using exercise so that we can maximise its effect in the treatment of type 2 diabetes.